Hello and welcome back everybody to day 40, well, probably 40 and 41, of our 7 Days to Die Alpha 19 survival. My name is Lainey from Early Gaming, and you might notice that most of day 40 is already gone. Well, last time we were all the way at our desert home, over here, and we made it all the way to our home. We turned in a quest to Hugh, and then we came all the way over here to Trader Wrecked. Now, this is quite important that we're in this town in particular, because there is a POI in here that I've wanted to do for a really long time, and it's time. Now, you might also notice that most of the day was gone, and there's no way it would have taken me that long just to make that travel. Well, let's just say that Camp Hope has received a little bit of a makeover. It already looks vastly different because I had a really weird idea, and I'll run it by you guys next week. But today, today we are here at Trader Rex, the worst trader in all of these lands, because we have this quest to turn in. Now, I should show you guys that I did get these boots. Over here, we got them from Trader Hugh, and we just switched uh, whatever mods were here, and we put them here, and we made one more mod so that it wouldn't be completely, completely worse. But now we have iron boots, which are a little bit better than the ones we had. Yes, we're still loud, but that's okay. Wipe that smirk off your face. Doing one job doesn't make us pals. Oof. Got it. There we go. He is quite literally the worst trader. Yep. I'll take the book, even though I, I don't really want to, but it's fine. Oh, yes, we have Tier 4s now. Okay, uh, Tier 4 home. That is something else. I'm, I'm just kind of interested to see what house would be a Tier 4. You know what? I might accept that, just so I can see. The other one is the waterworks and the church, which we have done already. I mean, I might still do it, but it's not super, super necessary. We'll sell that, and we'll see if they have any good candies that we can use today. Uh, health bonus, crit resistance, those are nice. Explosion damage, I mean, we're taking those. There we go. It's already looking up. Now let's head towards our destination. Oh, I just realized that I made it all the way over here, guys. And I didn't bring any heals. <laughs> this should be fun. This should be fun. And where is the quest that he gave us? Oh, look, over here. Oh, we haven't discovered this part of the map. Yeah, we'll have to look into that. We'll definitely have to look into that. But not today, team. Not today. Because today is the day. Yes. We are going to tackle the apartments. It was a long time coming. Okay, it is one of my favorite POIs. A lot of people are scared of this place. Yeah. It's a bit ruthless. But not me. No, not me. We're going right in. Now, I probably should have thought of this a little bit better, but I have a nice amount of ammo, and I should be okay. A little bit more ammo picked up over there. This is probably, the probably the worst part is that I am very loud, and I might call on every zombie at every floor. That is a possibility. He's gone. One popo down. Here they come. <laughs> oh, the shotgun is so powerful. All right. There's still going to be a couple more zombies. Oh, he looks so cool. Yes, guys, we are in Alpha 19.1 now. And they've redone the businessman, it looks like. Oh, look at his leg. Oh, poor guy. We know what happened to him. Okay. One of the apartments. Ooh. Oh, yeah, they haven't done the nurse yet. All right, let's take our little candy. Well, let's go to town.
Oh no. That guy surprised me and hit me at the end. Luckily, I haven't needed any medicine. So we're doing okay so far. And we've been picking up quite a few things on our way here. Um, absolutely no medicine though. So that is a bit disappointing. I don't want to go this way because I know that's not the way. And it's going to mess me up. But yeah, in this room, this part is always... Uh, I, I would say the hardest one. Because there's usually four zombies there to drop down. And it was so difficult the first time I did it. I remember I was so surprised. They were all radiated. I mean, I was a much higher game stage. So I suppose that's why it was horrible. Then a bunch of them broke in from there. And then there's some that are always here. So this is the most dangerous room, I feel. Yes, yeah, sure, the last room is always the hardest. But this is one of the toughest apartments, I'd say. But it wasn't too, too bad because the zombies kind of slapped the, the sides there for some reason. They didn't jump down. And now with the fall mechanic where they stumble, it's much, much easier. So we're going to continue. I don't want to go through the door here because I'm going to get lost. It's super easy to get turned around in this place. So we're just going to go out here. We're going to follow the path. Yep. And it leads me right into that apartment. But you know what? I'd rather know. I'd rather know. Then just aimlessly walk through there, and then I'll be wrong, and then I'll never be able to get out of here. So it's, uh, it's pretty... it can turn you around quite quickly, because all the apartments look very, very similar. Oh, fuck. Okay, I already knew them, but excitement nonetheless. Let's continue. We are going up once again. Um, are we though? Not definitely not that way. This way. Oh no. I'm getting flashbacks to other elevator shafts. Luckily, this one doesn't have a weird puzzle. There we go. Now, I brought so many guns. I don't know why I'm using just my melee weapon, but I guess because I had the candy, it seemed like a good idea. It seemed like something... Ooh. Oh. <laughs> that was scary. It seemed like something to do to save myself some ammo. But I got plenty of ammo, so I shouldn't really be worried. Okay, we're jumping over here. And we're in. Now I know it's almost nighttime, and I sort of planned it this way. I wanted it to be a little bit challenging here. I wanted it to get a little bit more difficult towards the end. And I knew that we would be here at night. <laughs> and I'm still thinking we're still going to be doing some more night. Oh. Why do I always miss with this thing? I'm so bad at the shotgun. It's so, so bad. <laughs> oh. Oh well. Okay. Nighttime is upon us. Here they come. Alright, I gotta reload. Oh, that was terrifying. I couldn't close the door. I thought that door I could close. That is a negative. Look at this. The floor damage is crazy on these things. Okay. Since we're here and taking a little bit of break, I'm gonna scrap some things just to make a little bit of room. But we did get a potato seed recipe. Finally. I mean, we were sitting around picking up quite a few of them, so I suppose it wasn't the end of the world. We do have a nice amount of potatoes, but now this will help. I really want to get the recipe to make um, the little vegetable stew or whatever. I think that's the best one by far. We're going to scrap some of these things as we need to make some room here. But we're looking good. We're looking good. So far, so good. And of course, we have our most prized possession, poopy water. Let's continue. <laughs> oh, yes. Double shot. Oh, the shotgun feels good. I mean, I might be bad at it. I don't know how you can be bad at something that shoots like point blank. But I, I manage. But that was still amazing. That was still amazing. I love that it has so much penetration power. I don't even have a point into the penetrator. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. It's fine. Everything's okay. dealt with oh. oh wow 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 they tried to gotcha me they tried to gotcha me oh sweet what did i get over here a magazine extender yeah i don't have a weapon to put this into oh that sucks so badly but still pretty cool pretty cool we got one and we'll continue this way where is the other zombie downstairs or upstairs i don't know <laughs> what? There's there's explosives here? Where? 
Where did he blow up? Maybe outside. Yes, there's explosives outside. Okay, fortifying grip. That's awesome. Steel spear. We're gonna scrap that. Oh, look at this bar. Okay. No worries, guys. I think I might have to put a box in here somewhere. Very soon. We're getting a little bit thick. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's horrible. My leg is sprained. What a joke. What a joke from a bird. Oh, never. Never lucky. Oh, no. Um... What have I done? <laughs> what have I done? What have I done? Okay, it's fine. Everything's gonna be okay. Just need to stay back. I have the firepower. Do not fear. Oh, okay. But there's a wolf. No, no, no. Everything's okay. There we go. Oh, planned. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea how we haven't cleared this, but... It's all good. It is what it is. I guess um, it takes us back down somehow. We'll figure it out. I'm going to make a box. All right. Excellent. Let's take one of these. It's five minutes, but maybe it'll help us out a bit. Okay, I'm reloaded. Everything's good. We're going upstairs. <gasps> yes. Well, I was going upstairs, but... um. I'm so glad we checked this kitchen. Why did I have, like, the the thought of checking the kitchen? It's because my bags are empty. And look what we got. We got a pumpkin seed. Excellent. But most importantly, guys, we can make spaghetti. Now, you can fight me on this, but pasta is one of the most delicious things in this world. And to have it in the apocalypse, well, I can't think of anything greater. Um... Well, other than surviving this building, that would be wonderful. Oh, this cannot be good. This cannot be good. Okay. It is definitely not. We're okay. We're just gonna wait for them to come down to us. <laughs> There's not gonna be a way up. By the time I'm done with this. I think they were hitting the floor. Oh no. Okay. Okay, this guy made it down. Cool. Alright, let's pull this weapon. Let's go, let's go. No fear. Alright. Your thing's coming down from the Oh, there they are. Okay, we got one. Anybody else? Anybody else wanna come at me? Trust in the light. I hope. Alright. There we have it. There we have it. We're doing it. We're doing it. <sighs> Bringing us back down. It's okay. It's okay. Got him. Oh, we don't got him. Well, not yet. Well, that's super convenient that they're standing behind those things. <laughs> yes, please. Yes, please. Oh. This is a really cool looking kitchen. I will say, it looks really burnty. I never thought it would do that. Oh, I can hear things breaking everywhere around me. Night looting is so scary. I love it. That's why I came out at this time. I wanted it to be a challenge, and uh, this game has not disappointed. It has not disappointed at all. I can't believe I'm carrying a singular potato. Well, we'll see. That'll be the first thing to go. <gasps> what? No. No. Yes, yeah, there's a screamer. Okay. Overreaction? Perhaps. Perhaps. Totally warranted, if I'd say so myself. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, the new utility worker, the construction worker, looks really, really scary. We have so much to go to. Oh, don't think about it, you know? Just focus on the now. It's almost morning time. We should be fine. Oh, some iron gloves. That's interesting. I don't know if those are better than the ones I have. It looks like the armor crit is better. We'll take a look at that in a little bit. But let's focus on what we got to do, which is survive this. Okay. I already see some boys and some up here. All right. Now, I've noticed if you crouch and you shoot, even though you might not be super sneaky and it's loud, uh, sometimes they don't pull, and that has something to do with how many times you shoot, I'm pretty sure. Because uh, if you shoot more than once, they will pull. Trust me, they will pull. Even though you don't, you don't mean them to. But unless you have, like, agility or something. But I am very loud. Very, very loud. And I have no silencer, of course, on this weapon. Or any weapon. I have no silencer at all. <laughs> I don't even have a pistol. I've only found a level one pistol. Which is honestly a little bit crazy. But that's all I've ever found. How did this guy not see me? I was right next to him. That was incredible. Same for this guy. Am I that sneaky? No way, I got no sneak damage. Or I get no sneak percentage whatsoever. I'll be honest, guys. I don't know what makes zombies attract sometimes. But I think it does have to do with uh, which way they're facing as well. So that might have something to do with it. Alright, there's more zombies up top. But I'm going to try to grab this really quickly. Okay. A light bulb. And more mortar tool parts. Okay, the mortar tool parts we don't need. But the light bulb. Uh, that will come in handy. That is very interesting that it comes at this time. I had already found some. So, I should be okay either way. Uh, let me gather all of this before we move on, and then we'll go upstairs. Okay, it is now morning time, so pretty cool. But I will say, I am super, super delighted that we cleared most of this at night. It was a challenge. It was a little bit scary, at times, at times. But we did well. We did really good. Okay, I just need to jump one more here. Excellent. I wonder if there's something you can do like this. Uh, to get into your home without making yourself stairs or anything for the zombies not to be able to jump up. That is kind of cool. But now here we are. The last horizon. Okay, there's birds. There's birds. Okay. We're good. We're looking good. Moving on. Carefully. Carefully. This is the last, the last stretch. Don't blow it now. Don't blow it now. Goodbye, bird. How dare you? How dare you? Okay, and I know there's more up here, but let's check what's inside here first. How is there nothing here? This is the biggest bummer of my adult life. Oh. All right. I like that might have been the more difficult room. <laughs> <laughs> the other one is scary, but this one, this one was, was rough. It's very small. That's what it is. It's super small, and it's got a lot of zombies. Here we go, though. Got some goods here. Oh, please, let there be some healing. Nope. It's okay. We can make our own. So there's hope for that in the future. Improved fittings mod. Interesting. I don't believe I carry any of that. And a book that we already had. We have to go out the window again? Oh, this place is so scary. So much heights. Go in here. Got him. Oh. Okay. 
backpedaling works in this game, team. Backpedaling works. It does wonderful things. Take him out. Who else do we have around here? Come to me. Come to me. This place is massive. Just absolutely massive. Oh yeah, guys, you might notice that I am... Um, I have quite a few points to spend. Okay? I might have upgraded the walls at our base. Just, just a tad. Just a lot. And we hadn't put some points in. So, overall, we're looking good. And I'm not using them yet. It's, uh, it's for a special purpose, okay? I would like you to suggest to me what you think we should put points into to make ourselves indestructible for a street horde. Because that's going to be... Oh, that might be one of our last hordes. It's going to be retrying... Oh! <laughs> Got him. It's going to be retrying the street horde. This time, we're not going to do it because I'm not ready. Even with these points, I don't think it's enough for me to go ahead and say, let's go ahead and do it. No, no, no. It's not enough. But, but maybe for the next one. Reloading is pretty important. It's what I noticed. And maybe parkour too. That would be kind of nice. But honestly, just reloading would, would change everything. Oh. Well. I knew Big Mama was going to hit me. Oh, look, you can see her undies now. <laughs> Is that a glitch? Or are they just... I feel... I feel bad. Oh, no. Oh, no, they're like adult diapers. Oh, lady. I'm so sorry. I didn't only have to kill you. I had to shame you. Oh, poor gal. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't know they would come off. They didn't used to pop out through her dress, but maybe that's just a graphical glitch going on right now. Got her. Okay, 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 okay. I can do this. Easy. Ah. You know, sometimes I'm on it. Feels good. Let's grab this guy. This guy. Oh, I remember this. Okay. <laughs> so you think you can shoot through here and you can hit his head, but you cannot because the chair has an area of attack here. Or like it has a, what is it, an object area that is bigger than it looks. So you can't do that. I've done this before. I wasted so much ammo there. Oh, I can't even tell you guys. There you go. Knowledge from Laney. A rare thing, but it happens sometimes. And there you have it. <gasps> Full on panic, by the way. Got him. Go back out and back up. This has to be it. This has to be the last stretch. <gasps> Are we gonna make it? Are we gonna make it? Wait, did we already pull the. Yep, we did. We did indeed. They're all coming. We got this. Oh, I heal. Let's close that up. I'm gonna put it in the bars, just in case. Let's do this. Come on. Come on, zombies. I got you. Oh. It's always the bird. It's always the bird, man. I hate you. I hate you so much, bird. It's just... Oh, it's an anger that I cannot even express. Well, there we have it. <laughs> it is certainly not bad because that was quick. That was actually really easy. I thought there would be more zombies up here. I really did. But it seems like they all came down and attacked us. So there we have it. Oh, beautiful. Now let's take all the loots. It's ours. Okay. Uh, that's a significant amount of mods. 
<laughs> More steel parts. I mean, they're trying to give me a hint. <laughs> I think I think you can tell. Let's do this. The luck will be on our side. Two shot. Not bad at all. Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh, guys, this is it. We're making it. We're doing it. We're doing it. I don't. I have no idea how I'm gonna take this with me. Uh, I think we could do something. Oh, I, I don't even know what to say. This is good loot. This is good loot. That was some ammo. And of course we have this, we can scrap. But we have a pistol level two. I said we only had a pistol level one. We're moving on up. Most importantly though, we got an auto shotgun now. Yes. Yes, dude. 12 damage, okay. I'm pretty sure this is still better. But I don't know if it's because it has the mods and all of that. I, I have to I have to test it out. Uh, the only thing is this one does have more rounds. So we'll test it out. We'll see how it goes. I just want to shoot it. Just want to shoot it. And then we got another level 6 robotic sledge. Yes, we had one. We had one. But I'm pretty sure the one we have has 15 damage. This one has 17. Not that that mattered, you know, a whole lot. But it matters some. And so I'm excited about this. This is still an upgrade. And of course... This is the good stuff. Iron chest. Mm. We really got to put some points into iron armor so we can move. <laughs> so it doesn't encumber our stamina so much. Uh, heavy armor or whatever it is. But I think this is worth it. I think this is going to be really beautiful. Really, really great. This is just as good as ours and it doesn't have any mods. That's how incredible it is. I'm just going to say it. This is, this is a great day. This is a really good day. I'm so proud of us. Okay. Freedom awaits. We're good to go. Look at that. Didn't even take that long. Wonderful. And I'm going to go to Trader because I am really full on inventory. We've got to sell quite a few things. We're a little bit rich. Just a little bit rich. And then I guess we have a little bit left in the day. I could just go. But I am quite interested to see where that home is over there. A tier 4 home is a very interesting prospect. I don't think I've ever seen a tier 4 home. I, I, I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I thought that they were all like tier 3. Uh, that's, uh, that's an intriguing proposition and we're going to go find out. Okay, he's got a couple of interesting things here. He's got Night Stalker Volume 1. We're going to buy that. You do 10% more sneak damage at night. I don't sneak a lot, but you know, why not? He's also got Sniper Volume 3. Headshots have a higher chance to stun and a greater chance to dismember. You know, when I get them, they're going to be good. Yes, guys. It's so much better. And we can still put another mod on it. <laughs> yes. Oh. Goodbye, Zombo. Ah. Oh, we're not going to get a chicken today. I haven't seen one. Oh well, what can we do? I'm gonna head over here to this. I'm just interested to see what it is. I, I might not do it today. It's been a long day. We've had, well, a long couple days, I suppose. <laughs> we started out yesterday night. But uh, I just wanna see. I just, see, wanna, I, just, I just wanna see if there's any town or anything else over there. And just what kind of home is a tier four home? That's intriguing to me. Interesting. Okay, I wouldn't have pegged this home as a tier 4 home. But we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> yeah, that's not, that's not bad. Oh, shotgun missile already. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yes, parts. Uh, this gun is ridiculous. This feels good. It just feels good. Yeah, that was a significant amount of parts. I'll show you guys everything we got at the end. Uh, those... Beware of dog. Oh no. Already. Hello. Goodbye, Zombo. And we're going in. Oh, I feel like we've been here before. This is a tier 4 home? Oh. 
a puppy. No, I've been to this place before. I just can't quite remember. He got one shot? Oh, imagine this thing. Level six. Would be incredible. Okay. Alright, well, we're breaking through the safe, and then we're moving on. <laughs> okay, we got a steel sledgehammer. We have a level five, so even if we wanted to go there, I think this might not be better. But this is still so much money. Look at this. And if we mod them... Oh yeah, thank you for giving me that suggestion. Somebody let me know that if you mod things, you get more money. I did know that from watching other people a long time ago. But I don't... Uh, I, I don't know how to say this, okay? I get lazy. Okay, so there's times where I do do it. And times where I just go, nah, and just sell it. I think there should be more things to spend money on. That's for sure. Because I feel like sometimes it just... I wouldn't be so lazy if I needed the money. Let's just say that, right? And I'm pretty sure that will blow up, so I'm going to stay far away from that one. Is he dead? Okay. That was my biggest threat. This guy doesn't matter. But as I was saying, if there was more stuff to buy from the traders, then I would keep more money. Yes, the solar panels are expensive, but that's the only thing. That's the only thing. Everything else is negligible. I, I I don't even need anything. And I just tend to craft things myself. I mean, the only thing I really buy is ammo. I don't buy any armor or anything. They usually don't have anything better than what I'm wearing. Oh, yes. That would actually be really good for a street horde. Um, I, there is the other one that gives you... Yeah, this one. Drum Magazine mod. I do have one of these. But the problem with these is that it does take longer to reload, right? And I think that's my biggest problem during Street Horde. So it might be more beneficial to use that other one for once, which is actually insane. Okay, we'll go this way. Let's get through this. I can't believe this is a tier 4. I've definitely been here before. I just, I just can't believe this is a tier 4. I don't know. It seems, seems strange. But again, here we are. Oh... <laughs> Dude. <laughs> rat remover mod schematic. We've made it. We've made it. Now, we had one or two rat removers already. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, there's one here. And there was one in our other shotgun. Yeah, over here. There you go. So, we, we did have two. But I love rat removers, guys. And if we have level 6 weapons, I'm gonna have them in all of them. I love those things. Later in the game, it becomes so, so important. Oh, no. All right. This is it. How is this a tier four? I mean, it was a freebie. Don't get me wrong. A real freebie. But how is this a tier four and not the one, you know, not the one we did with the burial grounds underneath? I, I, I don't understand it. I really don't. But, I mean, it, this is still a lot of loot. I will never complain. And our quest should give us something really juicy. We need to get out of here before... Before the trader closes. Yeah, we, we still have time, I think. Just need to hurry up a little bit and get this box. Okay. <laughs> so let me show you really quickly, because it's quite a lot. The polymer string mod is excellent, okay? If you ever get a bow, crossbow, any kind of bow, this is it. This is your mod. And unfortunately, I'm not really going bow spec, but it's still pretty intriguing. Still pretty good. Uh, I don't think I'm going to use this iron helmet. It's worse than the one I have. Uh, this is probably going to be scrapped if I had to guess. Uh, obviously, the Rodic Sledge, we have a better one. A lot of things here are repetitive for me, but I don't care. This is so much money. It's so incredible. Look how many parts I get. Uh, so many things. If you repair these, you also get a lot more money for them. Or a significant amount. See, this is 218, and if we repair it, I think level 4 and 5 is probably worth repairing. And now it's selling for 600. It's crazy. So, yes, you can also mod them. Modding them helps, but repairing them also helps. Especially tier 4 and above, I'd say. Oh, there's a little baggie here. It's just gonna be a can. <laughs> Never mind, at least this time it has water. There we have it. 
easy. Oh, this was only a fetch. This, the loot is not going to be incredible, but who knows? Maybe we'll get an upgrade. Let's get back there. <gasps> Holy! It happened! It happened! <laughs> yes! Our chicken. Our daily chicken. Guys. For a second there. I thought this was not going to be it. We were not going to do it today. But here we are. Looking down. At our prize. Good things come to those who wait. And for you guys who are still sticking around in what I am sure is going to be a pretty long episode. There you have it. Your prize, your reward for being a champion. Now let's go return this before they close on us. Oh, I know what happened. I know what happened. We went to do the wrong quest. That's why it didn't feel like a tier 4 home. <laughs> the tier 4 home is here. The tier 4 home is here. We didn't go to Rex. We went to this quest because we had it over here as a selected quest. So we did a tier 2 fetch. And I was like, why are we going back to Jen? Well, guys, we're going back to Jen, all right? Oh, that is so disappointing. But I gotta say, that home, I think that gave us so many things. It was absolutely worth it. Yeah, our reward is gonna be pretty bad. Uh, uh, let's be real, it's gonna be terrible. But who cares? Who cares? It's fine, it was quick, and we got it done before nighttime, which is gonna be incredible. Because tonight, I have a lot of farming to do. I'm gonna dig that mine down to the core. Because I have some big plans for next week. And they're going to require an immense amount of resources. Well, this is actually depressing. This is what she gives me? Okay, we'll, we'll take the shotgun one. Uh, just because. Why not? Oh, she has a book. We'll buy it. I'm not even looking at what it is. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just buying them. Well, let's get ammo as well. Thank you, Jen. It was wonderful. All right, so we bought quite a bit of ammo from her. A lot of 9mm, which I really need to start using because, you know, <laughs> we need to use this ammo. We use way too much of this, way too much shotgun ammo for fun, of course. But we, we got to start using our pistol. Now that we have a level 2, a whole level 2, we're looking up. But we got Sniper Volume 7. I can craft HP ammunition. Great. I'm really doing it just for the completionist, though, as we know. And we still have a thousand dukes left. Not too bad. Uh, there's more dukes in our gyrocopter, of course, and I'll show you guys the rest of our goods. Here we go, here we have it. Some of our booty, some of our things. Oh, we could probably sell these too. But we got a, we got a nice amount of dukes today. I've spent a lot of dukes, so the fact that we still have almost 7,000 dukes is incredible. And as I take my beautiful blueberry pie, I want to thank everybody so much for watching this episode. It was a bit of a long one, but as you could see, it was worth it. We got our beautiful weapon. We tested it out on a level 2 home that we thought it was a level 4 home. We'll never speak of that again. But I gotta say, the most important thing, we got the greatest prize of all. Our daily chicken. So thank you so much everybody for watching. And I hope to see you guys on the next one. Until then. Bye. <laughs>